The company that wants to mine uranium near Nunn has filed suit against the state's new uranium mining rules. Powertech USA Inc., which wants to use an in situ process to extract uranium in Northern Weld County, filed a lawsuit November 10th in Denver District Court. The suit challenges regulations that went into effect September 30th as a result of laws enacted by the state legislature in 2008. In situ mining works by injecting a solution into underground deposits to loosen them so they can be pumped to the surface. The new rules require denial of a permit if a mining company cannot demonstrate it will restore groundwater quality to baseline quality or better. The suit further alleges that another rule is a black ball provision that allows the denial of a permit because of one or more past or current violations by an applicant or by an entity or individual who is very loosely related, if at all, to the applicant. An attorney representing the interests of those opposed to the project said he did not think the lawsuit would succeed because of the lengthy public process the rules went through before they were adopted. No date has been set for a hearing. The owner of Fort Collins Foothills Mall emerged from Chapter 11 last week. Chicago-based General Growth Properties, Inc. is now the nation's second largest shopping mall owner and operator, with more than 183 regional malls in 43 states. Its Colorado holdings include Park Meadows and Southwest Plaza in the Denver area, and Chapel Hills Mall and Austin Bluffs Plaza in Colorado Springs as well as Foothills. In the restructuring effort, GGP paid all creditor claims in full, restructured about $15 billion of project level debt, and recapitalized with $6.8 billion in new equity capital. Representatives from GGP are scheduled to meet with City of Fort Collins finance officials on Tuesday, November 16th, to discuss Foothills' future. Reporting for Northern Colorado 5, this is Kate Hawthorne, and this has been your Northern Colorado Business Report.